Well, our project's with uh, the East Jordan Group. Um, they make water main valves between you know two inches all the way up to 16 inches. And part of the production of these valves, they have to test them at 75 and 500 psi pressures. The pressurizing of the system and the test itself take longer than they, they should. Um, and it's really bottlenecking their production line. So they came to us and they wanted us to develop a system that will take less time to pressurize um, and possibly be a better test. What we're working on is primarily the instrumentation for automating this process and also being able to test both sides of the uh, valve in one, in one fixture rather than disassembling it and turning it around. And these valves are heavy. They're between 75 and 150 pounds for the size that we're talking about. And so you have to, there's a lot of manual labor. Um, then you get into the ergonomics of repeated tasks and stuff like that as well. Um, so if we can cut those movements down by half, that should also cut down the time. It's a four-person team. We have one student that's a dual major electrical engineer, computer engineer. We have one student that's an electrical engineer and one student that's a computer engineer and myself as a mechanical. Um, I'm satisfied with the solution we came up with. We haven't, we don't have a working system yet. We've still got a couple of weeks before it needs to be going, but uh, we're kind of into crunch time right now. After you've designed something and then tried to build it, it kind of shows you the steps you have to take in your design procedure so that somebody's not going to have to be, you know, crawled up under that trying to work upside down on a, a pressure regulator. If we had designed that a little better, it would have been a lot easier. Here you go. Oh, thank you.